Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi ta'ala wabarakatuh Welcome to POT, Perlis Online Tuition My name is Mr. Ahmad Zahir bin Hussein And I'll be the host for today um, We are going to start our class with the doa recitation بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم الحمد لله الذي بنعمته تتم الصالحات والصلاة والسلام على أشرف الأنبياء والمرسلين وعلى آله وصحبه أجمعين اللهم أغننا بالعلم وزينا بالحلم وأكرمنا بالتقوى وجملنا بالعافية يا رحمن يا رحيم كم مهون كبدم dengan segala kerendahan diri sebagai hambamu Engkau indahkanlah akhlak kami Engkau perbaikilah pergaulan antara kami Engkau jadikanlah kami umat Islam yang menjadi teladan yang baik antara sekalian manusia Engkau peliharalah kami dari penyakit lemah, malas, berfikiran dangkal dan buruk budi pekerti Ya Rahmanu Ya Wadud Engkau baikilah keluarga kami, anak isteri kami, saudara mara kami Jiran tetangga kami dan seluruh mereka yang kami kasihi Engkau jadikanlah kami umat yang mempunyai ketinggian akal dan budi Mempunyai minda yang unggul dalam menguruskan kehidupan ini Dan menjadi teladan yang baik kepada manusia yang lain Ya Allah, jadikanlah negeri polis ini sebagai negeri yang ma'amur Rakyatnya hebat, mantap, bermentaliti kelas pertama dalam tindakan Hidup bersih, bersatu padu dan dilimpahi berkat serta rahmat dari sisimu. Engkau jauhkanlah kami dari bala dan kerusakan. Engkau tambahkanlah nikmatmu kepada kami. Engkau berikanlah kepada kami kebahagiaan hidup di dunia dan di hari akhirat. Ya mujibas sa'ilin, permudahkanlah urusan kami dalam menimba ilmu pengetahuan. Lapangkanlah dada dan terangkanlah hati kami Untuk memahami isi pengajaran Hiasilah diri kami dengan adab kesopanan Muliakanlah kami dengan ketakwaan Segarkanlah badan kami dengan kesihatan yang berpanjangan Dan berkatilah hidup kami dengan keredaanmu Allahumma inna na'udhu bika minal barasi wal junun wal juzam Wa min sayi'il asqam ربنا آتنا في الدنيا حسنة وفي الآخرة حسنة وقنا عذاب النار وصلى الله على سيدنا محمد وعلى آله وصحبه وبارك وسلم والحمد لله رب العالمين آمين آمين يا رب العالمين Thank you Ustaz Zul um, So today we are going to talk about writing Uh, as I promised, and before we start, I think I better get this one straight. Um, I'm going to conduct the class uh, using English, and if possible, if needed, I will be speaking in Bahasa too, to make you understand. Is it okay with you, uh, my viewers out there? Put up your hand. I don't see any hands, meaning that you want me to conduct in English all the way. Do I? Do I have any hands? No hands. I don't see any hands. Okay. Uh, for those who who are not very fluent, um, I think I better use some English uh, and Bahasa to make you understand better. Okay, our topic today is review. People are talking about review. People want to do review. They are very excited um, to review anything new, anything fascinating. And before this, review is usually done for, for films, for for uh, novels, for 
for places. But nowadays, people are doing reviews for most everything. Gadgets, new gadgets, new handphone, new tablet, new PC and everything. And usually, review is done by an expert. But nowadays, you don't need an expert because all the information for, to, for, for doing the review is at your fingertips. Bahan-bahan untuk kamu review ada di hujung jari kamu. For example, if you want to review um, a new handphone, for example, you can always search in the internet and then you have the information straight away, you on your camera and do your review and then upload, upload them uh, to uh, YouTube or to uh, your Facebook, so your source map, social media platform and everything. So, um, today, when I see the question for, for the writing part in HPM, when we started the review question, I'm so happy about it because for the first time in the history of HPM, I think the candidate are led to write something that they like most of them like something that uh, very exciting to them rather than the the five question which you have to write for 350 words and then sometimes you write halfway and then you don't have any ideas to write anymore but now for the review for this part it's only 250 words so it's quite easy for you to to write and of course you have to be very careful to choose something, uh, to choose your topic, and to make the review. So you have to, to prepare yourself. You have to know what expect to review for, for, for certain item. Okay? All right. Let's go. Oh, before that, before I forgot. Please uh, scan your attendance for those who, who are attending this class. You can use the QR code there. Pautan penyertaan, please. Okay, thank you for those who are done. All right. What is the meaning of the word review? What is actually a review? Okay, from the Oxford Languages Dictionary, review is a formal assessment of something with the intention of instituting changes if necessary. Okay, uh, formal assessment, assess, uh, penilaian formal, terhadap sesuatu, something, it can be books, it can be films, it can be um, events with the intention, dengan niat, eh, of instituting changes untuk melakukan perubahan jika perlu. Ah, so this is the real meaning of review. All right, a formal assessment of something with the intention of instituting changes if necessary. So, kalau kita ada satu contohnya, uh, sebuah uh, restaurant, tempat makan, uh, we want to review the place. If either we want to make changes, we want people to visit that restaurant or not to visit that restaurant, that is the changes. If you are doing a review on a film, you want other people to go and enjoy the film or not to go and not to waste their time. That is the changes, if necessary. What, what you want people to, to understand, what you want people to know. Okay. So that is the meaning of the word review. All right. Next. What to review? Okay. What to review? Uh, this one depends on the question. But we have uh, a few. 
I will go through this one and it is better for you to write down the keywords written here so that you will understand, you will remember and you know what expect to cover. Okay, we are going to go for the first one, movie. Movie, what to cover when reviewing the movie? This is the most, the, the, the famous one, the first one. People always uh, review the movie. Actually, sometimes we do the reviewing informally. Uh, we go to the movie, we come back, we talk to our friend. Hey, last night, I went to the movie. Uh, it's called James Bond, 007. It was a very nice film, you know. We talk about it, that is the reviewing. When you talk something about it, you better go. Uh, it's a box office film. You better go. It's a nice movie. movie. You, you're not wasting your money. You're not wasting your time to go to spend two hours for that film. So that is reviewing. All right? What to cover when reviewing the movie? Genre. What is the genre of the film? Um, Sci-fi, science fiction, comedy, um, drama, thriller, um, it can be anything, it can be anything. So the genre is also very important for, the, for, for other people to know what is the film all about. Actors, okay, actors is also very important. Uh, you talk about the actors. Whether he's famous or not, uh, you, can, you can always um, uh, add in uh, the, the facts about the, the actor. Um, for example, uh, Roger Moore, two times Oscar winner. You see, you, you're adding up the information about the actor. He won Oscar award for best actor for two times, for example. So that is adding up information about the actor. Uh, you can talk about the storyline of, of, of the film. You can talk about the director uh, of the film. Who's the director? Yash Chopra, for example, uh, a very famous uh, Indian director. What are the uh, best film he directed? The previous one. Maybe he, he, this is uh, his latest film, so the previous one, the most popular, the, the, the top chart film he directed before, you can mention it. Okay, location of the filming, for example, mm. Lord of the Ring, uh, the location is New Zealand. I think everybody know about it. So uh, you are telling them, oh, New Zealand is a very famous place very beautiful place so the scenery in this film will be very good so people will will have the intention to go and and enjoy the film the cause the cause of the film these are the facts which is very important the film cost 200 million so you can imagine oh, a film that cost 200 million will be will be a very good film if for example, the Fast and Furious, it costs 100 million in US. They are blowing cars, blowing very expensive cars, you know, blowing the Porsche, blowing the, the Ferrari, and they just throw away a car that costs 1.5 million in our country. They just blew it like that. So the cost of the film is also an element for us to review. People want to know how much is that film cost? Eh? Mamad Khalid made, make a film for um, three, uh, four hundred thousand and he's getting three to four million. So that is the fact that, that we have to know that, uh, so that many of us are inspired to make comedy movie and make some money. No, not just some money make a lot of money <laughs> okay um, box office for those who do not understand what is box office meaning the meaning of box office box office is actually the box 
the the small office right in front of the the cinema whereby people selling the ticket so if you want to buy the ticket you will go to the box office you buy the ticket but when the film is considered box office film meaning that every time the stick the ticket is sold out so when ticket is sold out it is a box office film if you go to the uh, the cinema you are a little bit late or just in time uh, you go and try to get the the okay to write a review about the movie it means you have to choose a movie you are familiar with so you can write extensively about it yes i i i agree i agree okay thank you um, so uh, that means where are we uh, the box office uh, if the ticket is still uh, you can still get the tickets man, means that that film is not a box office film okay so a comment here to write about a film that you are familiar with okay most of you are familiar with um, Korean film uh, Korean drama so I think you can use that one you can use you can use your 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 favorite film those who like uh, Hindustan Hindi film go ahead uh, you you watch Kuch uh, Kuch Hota Hai for 12 times go ahead I lost count of uh, how many times I I repeated Bobby uh, a, a film back in in 19, 1970s I think uh, I, I lost I lost count uh, I watched that film so many times uh, I enjoy the storyline I enjoy the song and most of uh, people old school like me uh, we still enjoy that film okay Oscar winners okay Oscar winners um, meaning that that film is recognizable uh, recognizable worldwide if a film won an Oscar award meaning that there are something that that you must go and see about that film can we just create a name if we don't know the actual person um, creating a name for an actor who is very famous then is quite odd but if the actor is not very famous I think uh, it will do okay okay can we just create a name if you don't know the actual person okay we just uh, we just we can mention the hero or the heroine the villain then it will do it's okay it's okay all right uh, you must remember that uh, what we are expecting is the language the language of the the the, the essay okay all right we go to the next one novel which is I think not a very famous one for you if the question come out to review a novel then it will be uh, very difficult for you since nowadays only those who are taking literature in English are reading novels those who are not taking literature in English only takes um, triple one nine then you have no novel in your spare pocket to talk about at least if you are reading those dear mr. Kilmer catch us if you can the pearl before this you can use that novel to review but nowadays it's quite difficult but you can still review any novel even though they are not in English and you can choose any any novel all right for the novel the most important uh, things to cover is the author the author of the the novel and if the author is famous for example a book written by 
Dr. Mahadev Bray Muhammad. So people know him. So when you talk, you review about the, the, the novel, then people will know, oh, he's a famous person and he wrote that book. So that is good. Okay. The storyline of the book, of the novel, uh, where it started, how it ends, and uh, the twist. Is there any twist in the story? For example, um, at first, character A, we thought that he's very kind. But at the end of the novel, he's the serial killer. Uh, that meaning, that is what we call a twist. All right? Language use. Language use. This is also a very good element to, to discuss whether the... the Okay, uh, I'm trying to read the comment here. No, the details. Can we create the detail ourselves, especially the... I can't see that. Okay. It is not wrong. You can create your own in the examination. If we don't know the details, we can create the details ourselves, especially when in examination. Yes, go ahead. Message, uh, blur. All right. Okay. That is the question from from whose? I'm sorry. No. Uh, it's quite uh, far away. I cannot see the 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 name. But I see the text, okay? It's all right? All right, we go on with our novel, language use, creativity, the creativity used by the author in, in writing the, the, the novel. Copy soul, if movie we are talking about book office. For novel, we are talking about copy soul. This is important. For example, um, J.K. Rowling, the writer of um, Harry Potter. Harry Potter's book sold 600 million all over the world. 600 million copies all over the world. So that is a very uh, impressive number. So when people uh, know that, oh, sold for 600 copies all over the world that mean meaning people are looking for that book people are, are dying to read that book so when that book is is out for the, uh, if i'm not mistaken uh, is the sixth one or or the seven okay uh, series of the harry potter and people are, are dying to buy even though the cheapest one is uh, the paperback book is about 90 ringgit, I think. And uh, the, the, the hardcover one is more than 100. People are queuing at the bookstore to buy the book. So, when there are many um, popular books written by that author, that means the book is very good. So, Sorry, 500 million all over the world. That is uh, the data from a few years back, but I think by, by, by now, it's already 600 million. Okay? That is novel. What we cover for novel. The author, the storyline, the twist, the language use, creativity, copy soul, um, and then I mentioned just now about uh, J.K. Rowling's book, Harry Potter, and also the, the film. Uh, okay, uh, if you try to, to take advantage of this situation, uh, you get information about one of um, Harry Potter's book and one of Harry Potter's film, then you can kill two birds with one stone. All right? So you know to cover 
the novel and then you also know how to uh, I mean to review the novel and you also now know how to review the uh, the film killing two but with one stone so that is good spare you have to spare that uh, information okay next we go to cafe and restaurant all right cafe and restaurant okay just now when we review the books and novel people examiners are familiar with with famous book with famous uh, film but for cafe and restaurant maybe most of them are not familiar with so you can create your own restaurant you can create your own cafe huh? if you don't have any any specific that you want to review you can create your own it is not wrong again i repeat it is not a sin to lie in writing uh, an essay this is the only place where teachers uh, give credit when you lie you create your own story you lie about it huh? teachers will give you credit teachers will not scold you for lying if the teacher call you uh, where's this restaurant you, you review about the restaurant where is the location of the restaurant no sir uh, I, only, I make it up it is uh, there's no such restaurant there's no such cafe I just made it up the teacher will not scold you if your review is good then you get credit for it okay okay uh, cafe and restaurant this might come up huh? so what are you going to review we are going to review what the menu bukan menu eh? menu uh, the menu uh, what is served at that restaurant is um, western is a chinese is a japanese is a masakan melayu uh, uh, mama store uh, it's famous nowadays uh, we went uh, for the football games at the mama uh, okay signature dish my spelling is it right right i think okay what is so special about the restaurant restaurant is famous for its roti canai okay all right uh, what is the price is it reasonable is it expensive is it worth uh, traveling for uh, the restaurant is about uh, 20 kilometers away from your house you go there every day is it worth your money okay how about the waiters huh? do they very helpful or uh, they have the face uh, something like uh, not paid for for the past three months the waiters are not paid for the past three months so they have this one look at you whenever you want to order you see he comes to our table with a pen and paper namagaba minum to saya and then go away not a smile huh? i frankly speaking i i've been to a restaurant in um, overseas the especially the 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 australian uh, whenever we sit the waiter will come to us very politely good evening sir uh, what would you like to order sir okay when i i i want to have um, fish and chip very good sir very good sir good choice sir and then if you ask them to give a suggestion um what do you suggest uh, you can try this one sir it is very good uh, it's very tasty and this is our signature dish all the words came out with a smile not magaba 
Minum Tu saya Mungkus Ikat tepi You see The face Alright So The waiters People also Would like to know about the parking Is it easy to park You can talk about that Special offers For whom For for the Disabled Those uh, I, I saw one 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 stall in Jejawi, if I'm not mistaken, yes, in Jejawi, which offer free curry puff for pregnant ladies. Free curry puff for pregnant ladies. You see, that is a very good offer. You know, people uh, when 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 you see that signboard, it is not just for your eyes. It is for your heart. So, you see, I can remember that, that signboard. Of all the signboard uh, I read on the way back from my school, I remember that one. Free curry puff for uh, curry puff percuma untuk ibu-ibu mengandu. You see, that is a very catchy one. A very catchy offer. Okay? Uh, visitors. Who visit the the... the the cafe, the restaurant. Restaurant uh, likes to take photos of VVIPs who come and dine at their restaurant. Huh? When when other not VVIPs um, customers come, they will go and look at the wall. Oh, this guy came and dined here. So they are proud to be at the place where very special people come and dine. So those are things that you can review when you write about cafe and restaurant. All right, uh, we cover three just now: film, um, novel, cafe and restaurant, and then the mall. Okay, unfortunately, <laughs> uh, the mall here in Perlis we don't have much choice so we have this the one at Kanga the only one I don't have to mention the name so if you want to review maybe for those who visited other places in Alostar the big one in Penang in KL London New York you can you can review those famous uh, Mall, and there will be a lot of things to to discuss. Okay, for mall, for supermarket, um, for this big shopping center, you can talk about the location of the the mall, the place. You can talk about the facilities offered. Some mall provide. Um, children's playground so that uh, the the father and the son and uh, the children will have the chance to spend their times together and play at the mall when while the mother enjoy the free time the the whole two hours uh, window shopping and shopping so uh, that are the facilities provided by the mall for the customers choices uh, there's not only one um, shop selling shoes there will be 10 shop selling shoes and you will visit all 10 and then after you finish the 10 shop you come back to number one to buy the shoes <laughs> uh, it's your money you can go you can visit you can you can window shopping it's your money you want to buy the best one the good quality but the cheap one all right uh, the staff are they very helpful huh? are they very helpful uh, sometimes you go and ask for sizes of your, your your shoes you ask the staff to get okay you go and get size 7 size 8 and size 9 you're not buying those three. You just want to know which one 
uh, fit you best even though you know size 8 is good all right it is also uh, a place where you can compare so these are the things that you can cover can you compare the prices of the shops all right so mall uh, i don't think that it is very popular uh, among you guys but it might come out here who knows okay um, we go to the next one resort okay for resort uh, usually resort are categorized by stars before this before this 20 years ago the most is five star the most is five star when we talk about it is a five star hotel meaning that is the best hotel in town or in the state or in the country itself five star five star meaning tip top service tip top room tip top facilities and everything but notice we have more than five star we if we even have a, a hotel claiming that they are six stars they are seven star they are beyond stars uh, i don't know maybe in a few years we have a hotel claiming that we are star wars <laughs> who knows okay uh, the location the location of the the resort the hotel the facilities um, uh, provided uh, olympic size uh, swimming pool you see olympic size swimming pool it will give the impression of the uh, of the size of the swimming pool at the hotel maybe some hotel build a very small um, swimming pool five meters long five meters wide and they claim that uh, we have swimming pool people were thinking oh swimming pool they booked the hotel went to the hotel and then oh five meter long five meter wide is this a swimming pool yes it is it's a swimming pool you take turns to swim we still have the swimming pool we provide the swimming pool we didn't mention about the size see okay facilities <coughs> other facilities gym we have gym put tape on the floor about one meter to queues up at counter during this special period okay put tape oh i see i see uh, i think this uh yo yi ning is referring to to something that uh, queuing up at the shopping mall whereby there's line provided by the by the shopping mall to keep the distance of the customer yes you can always mention that huh? you can always mention that you can always mention that the security guard is making sure that people are lining up they are keeping the social distance especially this uh, special period very good very good uh, that is also things that we can cover we can cover we can review in our writing all right thank you for yo yin ning all right thank you okay uh, facilities food some rest some resort some uh, hotel they have three or four restaurant in that particular hotel in one hotel they have a um, um, western hotel we have the chinese hotel the cru chinese cuisine hotel we have the japanese ho japanese restaurant we have the the bali cafe for example they they have a few restaurant in one hotel that one i think is a seven star the five star they even have this um, 
shopping mall, uh, they have a shopping mall in that hotel. So this provide facilities uh, to ensure the, the, the comfy of the customers. Okay? Uh, concept. The concept of the hotel, is it a modern hotel, a traditional hotel, modern concept with uh, tra traditional design, but it is still, um, I mean, modern facilities, but with traditional concept. It is not traditional concept with traditional facilities. The toilet, the toilet is outside. No, okay. Booking, how do you book? Yeah, using uh, internet booking. Uh, there's a few um, uh, platform whereby you can you can book uh, the the hotel. This is also can be reviewed when you write about a resort or hotel. Okay. Again, I repeat just now, um, movie, novel, cafe and restaurant, mall and resort. Okay, we have one, two, uh, five. Next, okay, next, um, a review can be about TV show. Uh, before I move on to this, this another, the, the last uh, pages, I will also would like to give credit to Mr. Shaharin uh, Guru Chamarlang from Kedah for sharing the notes. Uh, I, I took the notes and I rebuilt the, the, the notes with some of my ideas and I would like to, to thank uh, Mr. Uh, Zaharin for sharing the notes. Credit give, uh, goes to him. Okay. TV show. TV show could be a review. Uh, it might come out. You talk about the concept of the TV show. This one you like very much. You like what? Uh, those Korean comedy TV show, com I, I don't know what, I can't remember the names. Uh, the talk show, uh, I like talk shows. I, I like, I used to enjoy uh, Cosby, Bill Cosby. I like, I like to enjoy um, the talk show conducted by famous artists before this. They, they are very good. They, they, they invite a uh, famous person, not just VVIP, but maybe an ordinary guy who makes some good efforts toward the community, something like that. So you can choose either talk show, a reality, famous one, Academy Fantasia. That is what we call a reality uh, show. Documentary, people know about uh, the National Geographic, uh, Sir. David Attenborough, I think. Uh, people enjoy drama, sitcom, situation comedy. The face, famous one in Malaysia, for example, is what? Um, all those Imuda. Uh, I can't remember the name. P my P my Tang too. Very good. Thank you. Thank you, my friend. Betrayer. Is it your name? Betrayer. Okay. P my P my Tang too. That is one famous one. Thank you. Thank you very much. <laughs> okay. Uh, sitcom, huh? Sitcom. A host who hosts the 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 show. For example, uh, this is very important. Um, Arena Sukan. Arena Sukan. There's a one, one documentary, one, one TV show, uh, a very famous one. People dislike one of the hosts. Whenever the host is hosting that particular host, 
is hosting that that show the rating of the viewers will go down immediately people dislike him because he's biased to to some football team something like that the same goes to to the talk show about football in in uh, in our tv our our prepaid tv nowadays people will uh, choose another channel if that particular host is a bias okay we can talk about that again concept talk show reality documentary drama sitcom host and this one also you can you can talk about the 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 director the location the 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 cost the 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 rating and others okay um, next is the concert uh, the question might ask you you visit a concert a live concert a few months ago uh, talk about the the concert so is it a live concert nowadays we have we have online concert i think online concert we have you to you, you have to buy the ticket but you are watching the concert at home watching the tv but you have to buy those who do not buy cannot cannot enjoy the the concert sorry uh, it's just like uh, pay tv eh? the the film by muhammad khalid uh, the what the 15 ramadan something like that you have to pay you have to pay for you to to enjoy the the film you see when i mention that film muhammad khalid 16 ramadan when some people they they heard about that that name and that film and they will go and look for look for it you see that is something that that attract people to go and re review to go and view the film okay whether it's a live concert back to the concert live concert is it uh, done by a group scorpion uh, what uh, alley cats uh, those are groups i'm sorry uh, for mentioning the groups that uh, are very old the scorpions uh, members are mostly 70 years old nowadays but they still play uh, group solo done the concert done by one one singer and maybe he or she has a few artists uh, invited to join him but most of the concert is done by by him uh, the concept of the concert people want to know about the lighting whether it's good or not lighting uh, the sound system is very important you hate going to one concert with with bad sound system very irritating to your ears the echoing sound and everything so people dislike that okay uh, the audience how about the audience if you attend uh, the live the live uh, concert did the audience go hey why you or not you see all right so there are more areas that might come up for the review it might come up about competition you went for 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 games remember game you went for a game you went for a football game review the game the the, the team the supporters the surrounding the atmosphere the humidity of the game so uh, it can also be reviewing your new gadget this is what people like to do today they buy something they purposely wait with the box in front of the camera and they do this what we call unboxing it was uh, so there are ways 
that people do that make us wait, including me. Uh, including me. I also wait to see what is in the box. Okay, for example, a person uh, bought a, a webcam. A webcam. So the webcam came, so he opened up the box. You also would like to buy the, the same brand. You will be waiting to look at the box, what is inside the box. When people open up, you will take out one by one all the things inside the box and you will be counting. Okay, he, the seller provide this, provide this, provide this. When you buy, you will know what you are not getting. So, this review is also very interesting. Okay, you can enjoy the unboxing um, activities um, at YouTube and then you can try to 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 see what is happening what is really happening okay people buying things people comparing gadgets all these are review done i think millions there are millions review in youtube that you can enjoy you can turn on and you look and you see how they do it how they do it and then try to memorize try to remember on terms, on things, on areas that uh, they, they, they cover. Okay? All right, so far, so good. Any question? Hotel with toilet outside is something new. <laughs> no, I, I was saying that, okay, there's no such hotel. But no, wait, wait. I've been to a hotel whereby the, the toilet is outside. You have to go out. You share the toilet with other people. Yes, I've been to one hotel, huh? a very uh, a budget hotel. I, I've been to one budget hotel uh, overseas. It is very expensive. So we look for one budget hotel. Uh, I think it is only for Sixteen dollars per night. Uh, you have a double decker, two double decker, but the toilet is outside. Yes, I have. I've been to one. Okay, it's new. <laughs> okay, uh, betrayer. Am I right? Betrayer. Okay, Betray betrayer zero two. Okay, so the gameplay seems. As review too, yes, yes, yes. It can come out, it can come out, okay? So it is also a review, okay? All right, uh, what else? Put tape, all right, okay. That one is you, okay, betrayer. Thank you, thank you, okay. I need that, I need that question. I need that response. If not, I don't know whether you understand whether you are listening or not. It's very good. Thank you, uh, you, and thank you, Betrayer02. Okay, we carry on to reason for writing a review. Okay? Reason for writing a review. I put down there five. Um, I don't know whether we have uh, enough time or not, but I think if we can't finish it by today, I will continue on the next session which will be, uh, for my class, will be on the 30th of June, okay? Uh, I've not received any signal yet from my colleague back there. If they are signaling me, then I'll, I will stop, okay? Uh, we go for reason for writing a review, okay? Why we write a review? Why are we telling our friend? For example, we are not writing it. We just came back from, from, from the cinema. Uh, we met our friend at a coffee shop, uh, buying teh tari and teh ice. Okay? Uh, he, he, he was asking, uh, you, you are from? I, I went to the cinema. Uh, so you, you, you are telling him about the story 
what is the purpose of you telling to him the story about the cinema? Are you trying to tell him? Yes, go and enjoy the film. No, no, no. I regret going. It's a waste of money. It's a waste of time. You will sleep inside the the cinema. Okay, one story. Uh, you remember Transformers, very famous one, Transformers film. Uh, I went there with seven other friends, all are teachers, eight of us all together. We went to the cinema after having a course the whole day, so we thought that we are going to enjoy the film, Transformers, Transformers Master Force. So we went to the cinema. Of all eight teachers, eight person going together with me into the cinema, I'm the only one who's awake. The whole, the whole film. The rest, after five minutes, all doze off. I don't know how they can sleep with that all sound, but it is not interesting to them. It's a wrong choice. It's a no-no for them. Okay? I persuade them to go with me, but it is not their cup of tea. They don't like Transformers. I like Transformers. Okay. To convince, to convince other people to, to go, to read, to try, to eat, to visit, to use the facilities. Okay? To recommend to our friend. Okay? These three are the positive one. To persuade, to convince, to recommend. Okay? These are the negative one. Oh, no, sorry, the positive one. Okay, no. Transformers is the best. Though everyone like it. Yes! You are the younger, the, the young generation. My friends are all over 40s, so they don't like it. <laughs> Except me. Okay. Transformers is the best. Yes. All right. So number four, not to recommend. Not to recommend, meaning that it is not, it is not that um, we are trying to boycott, but we are trying to tell other people what is our opinion. But in case, in case it is written uh, and published uh, officially, there might be action taken by, by, by other people. But, but actually, sometimes the review, even though it is a negative review, people still want to go and see. For example, you said, oh, this film is not good. You know, the filming is not, there are so many bloopers there in that film. People still want to go and want to see the bloopers. So, you see, review is not just, not just uh, um, a negative thing. It is also a positive one. Uh, you talk about, oh, you don't go and buy at that, that uh, particular store. Um, the owner, the proprietor is a very fierce, you know, talk fiercely to people. There are still people who wants to go and see how fierce he is, how fierce she is. So it is not a negative thing at all. It can turn out to be positive. And then, these reviews are very good. They can be used by the owner, the film uh, producer, <coughs> the, the book, sorry, uh, the book writer to, to adjust, to make amendments in their next project. So they know what people like, what people dislike. So a review is a very good um, thing to use for us to make corrections. Okay? All right. Number four, not to recommend. Not to recommend, don't buy. Don't go, don't eat. Number five, to avoid. 
avoid this thing avoid don't don't do this don't go here huh? you might be um, caught red handed something like that there are a lot of scammers nowadays scammers scammers i i i've um, enjoyed one um, youtubers who wrote about uh, places he went in india and pakistan where there are scammers waiting for tourists uh, they, they 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 will try to 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 approach tourists and try to scam them so this youtuber he makes a video telling people not to deal with this person this particular person at this particular place for example if you go to madras you go to this road beware of this guy he will try to 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 take your money to scam you so these are things that that is very good for us okay to review all right um actually the, the most uh, popular youtubers for me is mark wins i like mark wins because um uh, the way the way he he review the food all over the world the way he eat and the expression that he shows is very convincing all right we go to the next one phrases associated with persuade convince and recommended these are some examples that i've collected from mr zanurin that we can use in writing our review okay the first one you must not miss the chance to visit that place to visit that restaurant to go and have lunch dinner something like that okay i'm sure i'm sure you will enjoy it i'm positive you will like it i'm positive that you will adore it okay these are very very convincing very very persuading statement okay if you want to convince people you want to convince your friend convince them 100% okay i'm sure i'm positive i'm certain you will like it i'm certain that you will not regret visiting that place okay uh, for sure undoubtedly indisputably obviously clearly apparently and then the last one i like this one i like this one i'm crazy i love i adore laksa <laughs> i'm a big fan of roti canai i'm passionate about kajol so these are phrases that you can use uh, to persuade to convince and to recommend your friends okay i think uh we have more um elements um, we have more phrases to to discuss but i think that's all that we have for today uh i'm going to stop here but i promise you i will continue this part on the 30th of june for my next session i will continue to discuss the phrases that you will use and you will be able to look at it and then you will be able to make some notes i hope i hope that you will make some notes about the phrases that i'm going to uh, show you in the next uh, class okay i think that is all i have for today uh, i hope you will understand uh, i'm opening up i'm i open up for any question you have 
any more question and please don't hesitate to ask you can type okay if there's no question thank you Ying thank you betrayer for participating so I see you again uh, next session on the TTS Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh stay safe stay home bye thank you sir